Gray, what in the world is going on? Not now, is he? Don't walk away from me. I saw you at Whitechapel. What? You followed me? I was worried about you. You fled like a madman after the battle on the bridge. You know nothing. Less than nothing. Is this some kind of clandestine infiltration? Tell her this. Is that what you're up to? This isn't the time. Gray, what's happened to you? Oh. Ever since Mallory was killed, I look at you and... It's been like five minutes. I know that's what I was about to say. <laughs> what do you see? It hasn't really been that long. I don't know. A stranger. Someone I'm not sure I can trust anymore. It's been like a day. Whatever it is. For God's sake, tell Actually, me. Actually, it's been like a couple hours. It's... Not this time, is he? And you do well to stay clear of Wait, me. Wait, he's about to tell the whole console? For your own good. And he's not going to tell Izzy? This is some, like, fabricated drama right now. She's part of the council! You just don't understand me. You! I tell you. Find General Lafayette and summon him to the library. This reminds me of, like, those... those... The conspiracy runs to the very heart of the council. Oh, boy. This allegation is monstrous! Those two are it, though, so. Yeah, I don't know. I refuse to believe it. If the Lord Chancellor will permit me, I can I show- I will not permit! If you think it's a problem within and the council- And you will say nothing more of these people. ridiculous suspicions! Now kill me, I'm gonna go drink some blood! All the years I've known your father, never have I seen him so obstinate. Your allegations strike at the very heart of the Empire. I fear he cannot sustain another blow as great as the loss of Mallory. All he need do is journey to Blackwall Yard. For what evidence? The destruction was total. A clear case of arson, according to Commissioner Doyle. Apparently, a small group of rebels was seen on the docks. It was all rather... What is the word the Commissioner is so fond of? Oh yes, elementary. Now what do you think? I have no opinion. Should you wish, I can attempt to persuade the Lord Chancellor to put the matter before the Council. If it is true that we have a traitor in our midst, word well, is bound to get back to the conspirators. What do you propose? Breach the walls of the United India House under cover of night. Any information that will shed light on the events of the last few days must surely be found there. Trespass on the Company's headquarters. You are cut from the same cloth as Mallory. Drastic circumstances call for drastic measures. Oh. I would have your assistance, Alistair. I hardly think it proper for the Knight Commander to be you seen- You know the lay of the land. I will need your guidance to navigate the grounds of the United India House. If a conspiracy is to be revealed, your testimony will carry weight with your father. Very well. But if he's the traitor, this is, like, no good. Why would you only tell two people? But the two of us alone will not suffice to infiltrate the compound. If what you say is true, there are precious few we can trust. My sister, Lafayette. I cannot involve them until I have more evidence. Then who? I might know just the person who can help us. The old, the old guy I think is you the bad guy for sure, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. It always, it's always the old guy at the head of everything because he stands the most to gain. Exactly. We're approaching the United India House. I assume we're not planning to enter through the front door. Not to worry. I've made preparations for our incursion. Gaining access to the compound proved to be a little more difficult than planned. Entrance to the compound. You could say that. Also, if Alistair's in on this, then we are so fucked. And Izzy's never gonna she's gonna be completely ignorant for God knows why. Oh, evening, sir. Francis. Uh, we're not gonna wipe our feet. It's raining. <laughs> what the fuck? Why are you wearing your shoes inside? <laughs> Somebody has to clean this place. <laughs> Rude. You 
have a love. Is everything in place? As discussed, ordinances on the table, rooftop accesses to the bedroom. You've done well, Francis. Thank you for pouring us tea. At your service, Aww, sir. Nice. So nice. That was Are we going to have nice. summer? No, we're, we're just going to walk version. all over his floor without wiping our feet. Rude. <gasps> just doing whatever. Touch all his stuff. Yeah, nice house you got here. Mm. Hey. Francis served in the Commonwealth forces. Oh. Ooh. Don't worry, bro. I'm just gonna touch all your stuff and uh. He's like, this looks sweet. Can I have this? <laughs> like, licks it. It's mine now. Okay, I don't want to look at it anymore. All right. Crossbow brings back memories. Ancient ones of like that. Thought it best we stay silent on this mission. Mm. Let's get going. What if we get Alistair killed and they make it look like it was our fault? Compound is patrolled all through the night. Guards man all entrances. What's the incursion point? The gardens. Should provide us enough cover to move in unnoticed. Follow me. Should head to the rooftops. Hopefully just make out with Alistair and just have, like, hot... Oh, that's so much better. Yeah, now I had ex-Alistair, like... Hold on! They had Hold sex on. in that carriage on the way there. They were like, I need to relieve some stress. <laughs> This is going to be a really stressful mission. I need to, you know, it's like... Yeah. Blow some steam. Yep. Pre-mission. That's why they're always talking to each other like that in the carriages. Hey. They're like warming each other up. We're going on a pretty tough mission. How are you guys feeling? They're like, I know what's going on here. We joined the order. Everything is about sex in this game. Well, that's the only way this game is good. <laughs> so... <laughs> Put some hot sauce on this game, okay? I can't not see that narrative, you know? Right, right? Because every time they're in the carriage, they're like, yeah, like, we're totally going on the mission, right? Yeah, we're going on the mission. <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> it's how you really build a solid bond of brotherhood. Fuck each other? Just jack each other off in the carriage on the way oh, there. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's just like, if they don't have enough time to get completely undressed, it's just like... <laughs> You know? Uh-huh. And then I saw some other female members, like at least one or two other than is that, is he? Yes. And they're like, yeah, this is happening. And they prefer to go on missions with each other because all the guys have been in here with each other for so long that they suck at sex with women. They're like, no, over What's there. His intelligence does pan out. A trustworthy <laughs> man, it seems. Not really. He has a debt to repay. Failure to deliver on his word will prove most unpleasant to him. We need to find a safe anchor point in the garden to secure the rope to. Quite a dramatic entrance you've planned. Well, that may be, but we should be able to enter the grounds on Gazebo seems to fit the parameters. Good. Let's deploy the line. Yeah, they act like lovers, for sure, right? Mm -hmm. Everybody acts like lovers. Like, here you go, honey. Done. Alistair, I need you to stay here and spot my path. Once I'm clear, I'll give you the go-ahead to enter. Very well. Uh, do be careful. My sister wouldn't forgive me if I were to return alone. See, I'm saying yeah. this. What she doesn't know cannot hurt her. This is why they get so upset when somebody in the thing, because they were all lovers with each other. It's just like one... One big, happy lover family. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I like it because it's like, no, you're in the brotherhood and now you're also part of, like, the sexy... The sexy brotherhood. Yeah. yeah. Grayson, I think it's unwise to eliminate company guards until we have proof. There is no time, Alistair. You have to trust me. This is the only way. Damn. 
Just get to the lower garden. The gate will be locked. You will need to find the key. So I'm just gonna go up. I need to find a key or uh, something. Who knows what? Maybe a dude? this guy. That was their friend, like sneaking up behind them. They would have shot their friend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, what if he's sneaking up behind him, being like, "Hey, it's your birthday!" Oh, oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, "Oh my god, I'm so sorry." He's like, "Fuck your cake." <laughs> oh. <laughs> Keep looking, quote unquote. Yeah. And he's the one that, Alistair was the one that was like, oh, we may not need to kill all of them. Oh, we need a key? Yeah, just murder those fuckers. <laughs> oh! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Have you found the key? He's like, damn it! Stop checking in on me, I can do it. Well, it's like, have you found the key after you killed everybody? No? Okay, well, just saying. We just have to keep killing people until we find the key? I guess. Is it. No, it's just ammo? Uh, it's a newspaper. No. <laughs> Not right now. They're talking about the power failure, I think, that we caused at the hospital. Probably. And this looks like it must be the door? No? I found the gate. Very well. Find the guard who has the key. Understood. And by find them, I mean kill them? All of them? What's going on here? Where is everybody? I don't know. Hello? Is that a guy? Here we go. But I do know that we don't, if we don't find, like, Oi! You! <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> they wouldn't give you the prompt? No! I, I have to start all over again now. Fuck. Alright, that's enough. I'm done. <laughs>